English Situations for Conversation and Practice Part 2 Television Rio, I finished my homework. Can I watch the television right now? Really? Mom said that you had a lot of homework. How can you do it so quickly? Nah, it's so hard for me. But I did some tasks at school before. Okay, I will give you 20 minutes to watch television. Thank you. You are my best brother. But I want to eat something first. My stomach is growling. Okay, let me go to the kitchen and check whether there is something for you to eat. I like sandwiches and hot dog. Okay, let me see. Anyway, why can't I watch a lot of television? Because watching a lot is bad for your eyes. Really? Yes. There are a lot of activities that you can enjoy instead of watching TV. For example, dancing, walking the dog, hanging out with friends, camping, etc. I see. That's good. 30 minutes or one hour per day for watching television is a recommended screen time for us. Yes. Thanks for your hospitality. Thank you so much for helping me. Don't mention it. Can I know your name? Sophia. That's my name. What's your name? My name is Emily. Thanks for your hospitality, Sophia. I have never been here so far and I don't know how to cross this street. I was waiting there for a while. I was so scared. Lucky to have you. Yes, it is not easy for someone new here. You are so kind to help people around. It's nothing. Everyone here is hospitality so just ask them for help. Yes, and I want to go to the supermarket. Could you tell me how to get there? Oh, really? I also want to go there. I can go with you. That's great. Do you live near here? Yes. Asking people to repeat and offering lifts in a car. Hi, Max. Why are you in such a hurry? I'm looking for a taxi, but it's quite hard to find a taxi now. Oh, where do you want to go? Central Park. I need to bring the key house to my wife there. She asked me for help. I know where it is. I can give you a ride. I'm afraid I didn't quite hear what you said. It's so noisy. I said I can drive you to Central Park. Really? Sure. Just wait for me a bit. I go to get my car in the parking lot. I'm afraid that it make you late. It's okay. I'm going to the zoo quite near your place. And it won't take a minute to drop you off. That's great. Luckily I meet you here. Finding a job. Katie, are you okay? You look quite tired now. How is everything? I feel really stressed before the test. Why? Ah, I have had an internship for two months. And now I have to prepare for the final test of the company to become an official member. I see. Some of our friends are also working at your company. I think they can help you somehow. Why don't you call them and ask them about the test? Oh, right. I am too nervous so I forgot that. Have you had any tests like that? I have some. But after overcoming challenges, I wasn't satisfied with the job, so I quit the job. Why? There are some reasons. I could not learn much in the first company. My main task was so boring. All I had to do is just type the date and repeated it. I quit the second because of the boss there. She is too bossy. I couldn't stand her. Now, I am thinking of finding a well-paid job. Oh, I think the salary should not be put on the top list right now. 
You know, because we have just graduated, the chance to get high-paying jobs right away is not high. I understand, so I will try my best to find an appropriate one for myself. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment on my videos. Please, subscribe to Learn English with Lucy channel.